Time now, 926. So let's recap the top stories making headlines in Central Texas. The family of Vanessa Guillen say the memorial held on Fort Hood was a beautiful tribute, but it doesn't replace the justice they're looking for. Protests for Guillen and other Fort Hood soldiers who died violently continue tonight, right outside of the gates of Fort Hood. Fox 44's Kendall Green joins us live in Colleen tonight. Kendall, what's the atmosphere down there? Out of things are just wrapping up here at the final protest, which was a lot more emotionally charged than any others we've covered tonight. But for right now, I'm going to be joined right now by uh, Vanessa Guillen's sisters, uh, Lupe and also her, her other sister, uh, Myra. Uh, you guys, there's been so much support here. How do you guys take that in right now? That, um, I'm really thankful and grateful because Vanessa's story has touched everyone. It has even touched the whole nation because we have a whole community behind us supporting what we're doing because this is an injustice and we want answers and we want justice for Vanessa Guillen. Absolutely. You guys will be meeting with President Trump uh, later on this month. Talk to me about your expectation with that meeting. Well, we're hoping for the best, um, a positive outcome, changes to be done in order for us to be able to help everyone else, every single soldier, anyone in the base that needs help, and hopefully make history in the name of my sister and you know it takes a lot for us to be here right now especially with everything going on but we're going to keep doing what we have to do i mean you guys have been embraced with a lot of support they're not going to stop that i'm sure uh, but we appreciate you talking with us all right so we're going to we're going to definitely follow those developments as this family gets to meet with president trump uh, in the future weeks but for now reporting live in colleen kendall green fox 24 news